Hi everybody. Uh, today I have come to speak on something important that is there in my heart. Uh, before I speak, I want to make something very clear to all those who view me. Let me tell you. Uh, these days, I've been coming up with videos of end times videos uh, and some. Uh, end times doctrines and all that stuff but whenever I make a video please please understand I am not targeting any one of you who are watching me if you are a preacher and uh, my views are opposing to your views don't feel that I am targeting you because there are many thousands of preachers whose views are opposing or opposite to my views if you are a Christian, uh, a believer or whosoever and still if you feel that my views are opposing to your views, then please don't think that I am targeting you. Uh, I just want to say that I love you and uh, all that I am doing through my videos is I am just sharing what I believe according to the scripture and uh, if you don't believe and if you feel you need to discuss something with me personally I'm always available uh, you can contact me uh, comment on my YouTube videos for my contact or uh, con con contact me on my Facebook and messages I'm always a bit available for discussion well so let me get back to what I want to speak this uh, moment through this video to you. I have two things to show you. This one. You know what is this? This is a face mask. This one. It's a toilet tissue roll. Why am I showing you this? The point that I'm making is uh, one year back you would see hardly people buying this face marks mask and uh, why I showed you this toilet tissue roll is because uh, when this corona issue started many countries especially the Western countries they found shortage of toilet tissue roll because of corona issue now what is the point that I'm making this this moment to you why there was panic buying of masks why there was panic buying of a uh, tissue roll and why there was panic buying of so many other things because I want to tell you fear sells faster than anything I repeat fear sells faster than anything so what is the point that I'm making if you want to sell something or if you want to if 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 you want to see uh, people buying a lot of things all they need or all you need to put into them is fear now the reason I tell you this is because I see during this days of uh, uh, this issue of Corona uh, many 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 Christians are uh, preaching believing sharing about the end times doctrine of doom and gloom and uh, what I'm seeing these days is uh, there is there is a whole thing in the air where people are saying hey this corona you see it's the judgment of God this is the plague in the book of Revelation this is going to happen and after corona ends uh, something else is going to come earthquakes are going to come floods are going to come and uh, by doing this we are we are working to share the gospel or to sell the gospel fast 
by putting fear into the lives of people. You know, once the corona issue gets over, people will stop buying these masks. Once the corona issue gets over, the whole hype about holding toilet tissue roll will stop. When we preach a gospel by putting fear into people's heart, let me tell you, when things become normal, they'll also forget about the gospel and forget about Jesus. Let me tell you what the Bible says. The Bible says, and I'll put the scripture on the screen, the goodness of God leads to repentance. Point number one. Point number two. The Bible says, where there is love, perfect love, and perfect love casts out every fear. There is no fear. So if we really need to preach Christ and we really need to preach the gospel effectively, we need to preach the saving power of Christ. We need to preach the goodness of God. We need to preach His grace and love of God. This is the point that I'm making on this video to everyone. I want to tell you, I personally have done enough of my studies in eschatology, in the end times doctrine, and I believe that we are in the kingdom age, the kingdom of God is here, Christ is here with us. And I believe that all things will get consummated in his final coming. So I do believe there will be resurrection of the dead in the end and Christ will uh, appear once again in his fullness. But what I don't believe is I don't believe in the rapture doctrine. I don't believe in this doom and gloom uh, prophecies where people are saying that the sicknesses, earthquakes are, are going to happen before the coming of the Lord. Now I can't explain everything in this video. If you want to know why I'm holding this viewpoint, I have a whole playlist on my YouTube. I want you to check it out before you come to any conclusions about me. I repeat, I don't believe in rapture, but I believe that Christ will come in his fullness. There will be resurrection of the dead. There will be resurrection of all of us. So I'm making that point clear this evening. Because there is difference between rapture and there is difference between the final coming of the Lord. Saying that, I want to encourage people who are watching me. Today, there is so much of fear because of this uh, corona issue. And to add to it, we are... We are putting fear into the hearts of people, telling them that God is going to destroy this world, there's going to be more earthquakes, there's going to be more sicknesses, there's going to be more calamities and we keep on piling fear into the hearts of people. My dear brothers and sisters, let me tell you, these are the best days. The reason I want to tell you is this. Because if you know history well, and if you know the Bible well, you will see that there were past instances which were more worse than this. There was one plague, I think it's bubonic plague, which happened in Europe years back. Half of Europe was dead. People were swept away, half of Europe through bubonic and this is just corona guys it's not it's i'm not saying it's not dangerous it is dangerous but it was not at least as dangerous as that there were world war one 
वर्ल्ड वॉर टू मिलियंस ऑफ पीपल डाइड टूडे वी आर सेफ एंड सिक्योर इन हाउस इज इन द पास्ट देर व मोर वर्स थिंग्स हैपनिंग वाई एम टेलिंग यू इज आई वॉन्ट टू टेल यू दैट थिंग्स आर गेटिंग बेटर एंड द एंड टाइम्स डॉक्टर इन दैट आई होल्ड ऑन टू is that when christ is going to come in fullness he is going to find the church in a very glorious state he is going to find this world in a good state i hold a very optimistic view whereas the other side believe that there will be earthquake there will be troubles there will be tribulation there will be antichrist all this stuff the world is going to go bad 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 and things are going to be worst and then christ will return no i don't believe so because practically if you see things are getting better now at this age we have the best medical uh, backup now at this age we have a good education system we have good technology now at this age there are more christians than any time in the entire world i mean when when uh, the first church in the book of acts started when the holy spirit came during the time of pentecost around thousands were saved around thousands christians were there in this earth on this earth during that time today there are millions i think billion of people billions of christian on this earth so as god has promised we are going to move from glory to glory as god has promised the knowledge of his glory is going to fill this entire world as christ has promised these are the things that are going to happen that we are going to be experiencing the golden era in the future and then christ shall return in his fullness that's the point that i'm making and why do i believe in everything before you come to an conclusion watch my videos on the end times it's all scripturally backed up so i urge you go into my youtube there's a playlist on end times go ahead and watch it i am saying at this point of time we need to preach the saving power of jesus during this point of time we need to preach that everyone who believes in him shall be saved from the sickness from calamities everyone who believes in him salvation will be theirs i believe in the days to come we christians who believe in jesus will have no not go through any judgment because we believe in jesus so that's the point that i'm making i want to tell all my viewers who watch me watch my videos i want to tell you a good news the gospel is a good news and i want to tell you there are great days ahead things are going to be be better corona is going to go away things are going to be better i want to i've come here to give you hope and hope in christ be blessed and rejoice for Christ who is there inside of you is still the king and god bless you